What's going on guys, it is Andrew here, and welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's 3. This is a fan-made game, it was not made by the official creator of Five Nights at Freddy's, but... Uh, from what I saw, it actually looks really good. It's a very, very good replica of Five Nights at Freddy's. Five Nights at Freddy's is extremely scary, and it's an extremely popular game. I know a lot of people love it, so I figured people probably want to see me shit my pants again, because this game always makes me soil the undies. Let's get right into it, and hopefully these pants will stay clean. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza is fixed. The ever so popular pizzeria animatronics have been fixed and repaired at last. They have also fixed and brought back everyone's favorite pirate fox, Foxy. The murder of the four children and one missing child has yet to be found. They also brought back something from the old pizzeria, something to bring back in hopes of joy. Children grows up all alike. Ah, I didn't get to read it all. I'm a slow reader, man. Every time a game has like a reading section, definitely never finish it. What's toxic? What does that mean? Yes. I apologize for what happened three nights ago. I thought they, well, well, he was after me. Probably not. Anyways, it's just my problems. Nothing, nothing you should worry about. If you ever find a, if you ever find an empty Freddy Fazbear head lying around, that's from the previous location. We just use that for kids now. But considering the fact that it's been with us for for years now, it's probably toxic. I wouldn't recommend it. I wouldn't recommend wearing it <laughs> for, for too long. Uh, well, I have some news from the company. All animatronics have been fixed and no longer act unusual around adults now. They are su now super kid and adult friendly. I bet they are. They bring back the puppet from the old location. They found it a few days ago and thought it would be nice to bring back something special. Yes. I really didn't like that puppet. Even after so many years, they walk around the day once. They now walk, they walk around the day once again to please the children again. I'm glad the whole body of seven is behind us now. They should they should act fine during the night. Just keep an eye on that puppet. I don't trust it. The puppet. Uh, even if it went, even puppet. This went puppet. Through, Where's the puppet? Don't put the mask on instantly when you're when you first show up or to at work. Just do one at a time. They should think you're just you, they should think you're one of them and ignore you. This voice right. actor is not very good. Anyways, that's just a thought. If they were acting up again, if they were acting up again, at least uh, they probably won't. Uh. Well, you should be golden. Just remember, use the mask, use your mask, one at a time. And only if necessary. Okay, good luck. Right. The only thing I have to say is, you think that when he screwed up, they'd like re-record that. Anyways, I don't really care, because it's frick! I freaking didn't know where the puppet was, and now he's out. And he's probably gonna catch me. And eat my ass. I want to click that little muffin. Okay, never mind. It's a cupcake, Andrew, not a muffin. Where the hell did he go? Oh, there he is. Why does he look transparent? Oh, great! He's on all the TVs. Oh, that's great. No, that's uh, that's what I wanted. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> I freaking hate, I hate Five Nights at Freddy's. I hate this game. I hate it. All right, so our gameplay this time, game plan this time around, figure out where the dumb, stupid thing is. There he is. Does he have a music box that I gotta wind? Creepy ass music, man. I don't, it doesn't have a, a wind up music box though. Maybe I just gotta keep watching them. Cam four. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Woo! It's just what we needed, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so there he is right there. Let's see what happens if I stay in here.
All right, so I'm pretty sure I know what you have to do. I think you literally just have to watch the marionette the whole night. Because he is impossible to stop once he gets out. And at least watching him keeps him in for a while. Can you give me your epic beats until at least 2 a.m.? I mean, Omega super crazy sounding. But at least I know you're in here. And that's reassuring. So I'd rather listen to the crazy, creepy little kid music than die. If you feel me on that one, Marionette. I think you do. If you give me until at least 2 a.m. in here, if I can catch you in the dining room, give me another two hours there, catch you in the hallway, you give me two hours there, and it's 6 a.m. Boom. I got a plan. Dude, there we go. She just wants some food. It's like, please, sir, can I have some pizza? <laughs> this plan might legitimately work. All right, it's four. Give me till five, baby. Give me till five. I think I got it, guys. I think I actually just clinched this night because... I only have less than an hour now. It, it ends at 6, obviously. And it still has to go to the closet before it comes to me. So I'm good. I think I just won it. We still have 59% battery. Unless unless one of the other animatronics get me. But I know for a fact Marionette's not going to. Come on. <laughs> oh my god! That is the stupidest thing ever! What a dumb plan, and it worked. Thank the lord. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah, the little... Yay! Same plan, just stare at Marionette the whole time. No, I don't know what the plan is going into night two. Let's open up the doors. Let's hear what let's hear what uh, Buddy Guy has to say. What's up, Buddy Guy? Uh, hello. Hello. Uh, hi. Hey, glad you made it. How's your night of no worries? Uh, never mind. The animatronics are acting up again. During the day, the CEO had the engineers work on the animatronics. Every time they act up, they look around to check on the place. Then go to assist a reboot after they're done. Also during the day, the engineers found the wiring in the animatronics messed up. Uh, did you remember to use a mask one at a time? And only if necessary? I was just wondering. I don't want anything happening to you. Uh, the engineers also found the, that the animatronics get more... Uh, Aggressive the second time you look around. Just a heads up. Uh, something I forgot to mention. Flash your light in the dark areas. That would be an event in the hall. They should not be. They should not be able to go into the vents. Uh, but, but make sure you don't use too much of your flashlight. Uh, doors don't seem to work very well. You know, you know, when Foxy comes towards the office. <laughs> eh, he kind of broke the doors. I don't think the doors will work on them anymore. They are more stealth than before. Uh, so I don't think the lights will work on them either. Well, I wish you the best of luck. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Thank you for not talking anymore. Because no offense, guy. But your voice acting is awful. <laughs> Sounds like I'm watching a poorly remade Japanese like anime that's like made in English, and they're like, <laughs> "Oh great, I'm totally gonna die." By the way, I'm pretty sure the plan from night one is exactly what you got to do for night two. Look, I'm about to die again for Marionette. I'm pretty sure the plan from night one is the exact same plan for night two. I'm pretty sure. Well guys, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here. If you enjoyed it, make sure you leave a like. Do you wanna see more of Five Nights at Freddy's 3, the fan-made version? Um, I think I'm pretty sure I can beat night two. Maybe in night three it changes. Maybe night two, that's not even the game plan, but I think it is. It seemed like Marionette was super aggressive like it was in uh, night one. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love your faces. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you wanna see more. Let me know in the comment section if you wanna see more. Bye-bye. <laughs>